How'd you uh, how'd you keep your jacket so muddy? Well, the dump truck PTO broke yesterday, and I was trying to dump at a site in Eden Prairie, and I had to crawl under there in like a pond to uh, do it manually. <laughs> you got it real nice and dirty. You got some fresh ones coming today. Sweet. You like working in the snow, trying to grade snow and stuff? Yeah, it's not too bad. I mean, you sitting at home. Yeah, right. definitely. I agree. All right, folks, got my plowing hat here naturally because there's snow on the ground. Snow when the snow comes, my plowing hat comes out. So this is a project, commercial project. We're either making just two boulevards here go down a ways. This is Maple Grove, Minnesota, mulching around all the drip lines of these spruce trees, these evergreens. And then I do something with the snow and we're hardly raking this. Adding topsoil, different companies come and do irrigation and then we're sodding it. So this project was from a local sod farm. We went to a new sod farm this year. We weren't super happy with the one we had last so year. We, we were, we're really loyal to our suppliers. We pick one, we get everything we can from them. So this was a referral. This is about a $18,000 job. We got this from a referral from the sod farm that we go to. So that's what it's all about, building uh, good relationships to where you get referrals from every, every, everyone you spend money at, everywhere you spend money, you should be getting referrals from. Because we do like where we get sod, where we buy our equipment, where we buy blocks, um, the sand and gravel materials, you get referrals from all those places. So that's what it's about, building your network. Your network is your net worth. Remember that. All right, I'm gonna buzz down, grab a few uh, pieces of drain tile and buzz down to yeah. Minneapolis to go to another project we got going on there today. So see you there in a bit. All right, folks, so here I am in uh, Minneapolis, one of the few jobs we've done in Minneapolis. We don't really advertise much down here. We don't really do, uh, we're not seen around here much. We're more the North Metro. We do come down here for certain jobs though. So this is a job that was uh, referred to us by Stan Genetic. If you wanna know how I got to know Stan, everyone on YouTube seems to know him. If you're watching this video, I'm sure you've watched some of Stan's. So this was a job that was uh, referred to us by him. It's uh, taking out about 110 foot uh, black wall. It's an old failing black wall. Starting down here comes up. It was about four and a half to five feet, so we're gonna get up right to four, then we'll grade it out. Come down. Step here, comes up, do little returns on that. So anyway, um, I was saying earlier how your network is your net worth. We got this job, this is about a $23,000 job, and this was just from knowing Stan, from knowing the right person. Um, so just, just today we were doing over $40,000 in work that's from people that we work with that we know with zero advertising, spending zero on advertising, just building good relationships. The second job today, the third job today was about a $12,000 shrub job um, that was actually for a builder that he posted a picture of a house, said he owned a house for sale, whatever, come check it out and there's no landscapes. I commented, hey, you need landscaping, hit me up. And he called me and we've done $100,000 of work for him since and that was from a Facebook comment. So like all three jobs today, we didn't spend a cent on advertising. We do spend a fair amount on advertising, but none of these jobs came from that. So that's what I'm saying. It's, about, it's all about uh, building your network. I think I have like, around 1,400 contacts in my phone. That's 1,400 connections, and every single one of those people knows another 100 people, and they know another 100 people, so like, it really spirals. So it's about building good relationships, being loyal to your equipment dealers, your material suppliers, like gravel, whatever, whatever industry you're in, whoever you buy materials from, building a relationship with them so that they can give you referrals. Knowing other people in the industry, I know a lot of landscapers up in our area, North Metro. I know I've talked to or know eight out of 10 that I see. Get a lot of work from them. We should work that they don't have jobs that they don't have the equipment for, or they don't they have time to get to. So that's what it's all about. Like all three of today's jobs were from people that we've known, referrals, our suppliers, things like that. So we have billboards, yeah, big vinyl. We do Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, a little bit of YouTube. We've got a couple jobs off YouTube. Yeah, that's all works, but really the best work is uh, referrals and uh, repeat customers. So yeah, that's kind of where we're at today show you kind of what we're doing here. This is, uh, it was like an old black wall, it's about 30 years old. And then the customer wanted something gray, some kind of more consistent gray. So we ended up going with like a natural um, St. Cloud granite uh, boulder. Any problems with the grapple here? Yeah. Is it leaking fluid or something? Yeah, everything always rattles apart on these things. <laughs> on this one anyways. Yeah, we've had a few few minor issues with leaks so and stuff on the too. CMP, but nothing, uh, nothing major. Just a little, occasionally a fitting will come loose or something. Hey, did that cup is probably good. Okay. Right. 
CMP attachments, if you didn't know, it's uh, the Clearwater, just about 15 minutes from our shop. They make all kinds of excavators, you can see attachments, they're on Instagram, Facebook, a little bit on YouTube, just check them out. So here's the wall. Just getting going here, this is about 18 in ton, got about 70, 75 total coming. It's off the main road here, obviously, in uh, Minneapolis, so we had to get uh, traffic control, get a permit. So the cones went off to close off the sidewalk in part of a lane. So kind of nature of the beast. So, all right, guys are gonna keep plugging away. We got a time lapse uh, going over here. Time lapse right up there, so maybe I'll see if I can get that in here, but keep plugging away and get this thing done. Here's from the stairs below, bring the wall in, bring the wall in and go up, make little returns up the sides, and then it goes down and uh, wraps around down here. Yesterday was a short day, the guys left at about one, got here about eight, left at one or two, got all the wall, wall tore out all the way, and today is uh, installation day. So we got all this field stone from Derek at C5 stone. Um, he is a rock supplier in central Minnesota. I think he goes all over Minnesota, a little bit of Wisconsin, and even, I don't know if he goes North Dakota or not, but he, he goes quite a ways. So that's another guy that we, we work with plowing. I got to know him through some, through one of our equipment dealers. So that's another guy that we done some networking with that's been a really good relationship. Rented a skid steer from last year. He plowed snow for us last year. It's been, uh, it's been good. That's Derek at C5 Stone. <laughs> 